late night work snacks. Delish. A little bit of toast action going on here. Back to the waivers. Yum. So delectable. Oh, well, bust it up. Bust it up. It's all good. It's all good. Gotta smash the yolk yolk because your girl does not like the yolk or any like that. I have to cook it. There we go. There we go. So I was just on the phone with Bay and I was like, Babe, my hair is getting long. So excited. So excited about that. It is Thursday morning. It's my one day off and today was super crazy because we had this thing called um, downtime. It's when all the computer or basically the system that we work with is completely turned off. So we have to do everything manual like the olden days and it just takes forever. Can't find anybody. It's just a hot mess. But anyway, today is my one day off and it's not going to be a fun day. Unfortunately, I do have a funeral to attend today. So... Uh, we'll see how that goes, but um, I'm going to try to get a little bit of sleep and then get up and ready for that. So that's what my one day brings me, unfortunately. So I don't really like to get into religion or anything, but um, if you guys could just, um, you know, send good vibes or pray or whatever you guys are into, you know, send um, just good thoughts towards uh, the Fuentes family because they did lose their daughter. Um, she was only 20 years old, unfortunately. And it's just, um, it's just sad. You just never know when your time is, but and so you always got to live your life to the fullest as cliche as they say. But, um, you know, I do try to be happy and do everything that I want to do. And I just want people to be happy for me. And I'm kind of going through my own thing right now, but uh, but anyway, just pray for the family um, that um, they can get through this. It's not easy for anyone when you lose someone really close to you. So I'm just hoping the best for their family. And um, I just been, they've really been on my mind lately. So basically just thank you for sending prayers to their family and um just help them get through this rough time. So I am back home um, from the funeral. That's never easy to go to. Um, but I, after that, I was with my cousin. We went to the styles. She was looking for an outfit. And then I had to come home because I'm starving and I have to go to the grocery store. And I just have some other things I have to do because it's my one day off and I have just shit to do around the house. So that's what's happening right now. So I had heels on or wedges and I took them off because I'm trying to be comfortable in my casa. But David mentioned tuna sandwiches and I thought that just sounded so bomb because this is like a billion degrees outside. Not really, I think it's like 94 degrees outside. But still, it's hot and um, I don't like seafood. If you guys know me, you know I do not like any type of seafood or spicy food. I'm like a weird ass Mexican. But anyway, um, I have to be like in the mood for tuna or, you know, seafood, whatever. I'll like, I will eat tuna, but I eat it like once or twice a year and it has to be hot outside and it is hot and it sounds bomb. So your girl's eating tuna and it is delicious right now. So I'm doing that before I go to the grocery store because if you go to the grocery store, you just buy shit that is unnecessary, irrelevant, and you don't need it. So yeah, tuna with tomato. And I am putting it in a sandwich and it is delectable. So we just gave my dog a bath. Now, time to blow dry him. Okay. Little guy, little guy. He hates it, but no, we don't want him to feel like a wet dog. He's stanky, yo. So I should be cleaning my room, but 
We're doing a little Sunday action going on. Well, it's not really Sunday. It's cookies and canines. Hi, Natalie Bear. Yep, and we're going to watch some mystery stuff. Mystery, because we like to watch the mystery channel. I mean, not mystery channel. Well, it's the what? The DI. The DI. What is it called? Like the Discovery Mystery Channel. It's like murder mysteries and stuff. Yeah, we like to watch all that gory craziness because it's real life. Not the scary stuff. It's the real. I mean, it is scary, but not like monsters. This is real life. Killers, shooters, stabbers, murders. Exactly. Kidnappers. We're gonna kidnap her. I'm coming to your house tonight. <laughs> so this is what you call sour cream and tapatio mixed together. Oh. Mixed together with the Dorito. That's why it looks a little bit reddish. It's cup of tea and sour cream. Bomb dip. What are you doing? You gotta be playing with that goo, homie. What are you playing with? With goo? Hey, don't play with my. No, 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 you don't eat it. <laughs> hey, what you doing? This fool was gonna eat your goo. What you doing here, Willis? Favorite <laughs> turkey, Jenny O, baby. From the deli. Making a sandwich for lunch. And also breakfast. That's why there's eggs. So making lunch and breakfast at the same time. We only slept for like 45 minutes. But I forgot Nissan freaking made me an appointment to come in today. So that's where I'm going right now. Freaking Nissan. Then I'll go home and go back to sleep I hope. I hope. So I'm on my way to my mom's. It's actually Father's Day, but unfortunately I worked last night and I worked today. So we're gonna jump in the pool for like an hour or so and then have some carne asada. But um, I'm not with my dad. He's actually with my brother right now. So happy Father's Day, dad. Love you. I already called you, but I'm gonna hang out with him next weekend. And yeah, hopefully, I don't know. I think I'm going to jump on the pool though because it is a freaking hot. I do have my bathing suit on. Sorry if I'm like looking incognito. I look, I literally just woke up and got up, brushed my teeth and I left. Oh, and I, well, and I packed clothes of course because I do have work like I said. Sorry, I shouldn't be driving and um, vlogging, but I am. I do it all the time. Bad girl, bad girl. But anyway, just want to say happy Father's Day to all the fathers out there, including all you single mothers out there, hey. But if not single mothers, and still just even the dads that don't have the mom in the picture, just good job for you. But yeah, I just made it to my mom, so I'm going to get off the phone now. Can we go back in the pool now? No. Huh? No. No. <laughs> Where are you going? <laughs> yeah? 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 What? Let's go in the pool. Let's go in the pool. It's my one day off and it is actually 5 o'clock in the morning. Uh, my day off was technically yesterday, I guess. So, I just got done editing two videos, um, which you guys will see. I posted it um, already. And the one, it's going up. Well, I have it on private, so I don't know when I'll post that one. But probably in a day or two. But I'm feeling sleepy now, so I'm probably going to hit the hay. I'm trying to be like Franklin over here all passed out. <laughs> He sleeps like a king. Doesn't he? <laughs> oh man, I love this kid. Breakfast time. Get out my wheat toast. Quite delectable, quite perfection. Got myself a yummy turkey, egg, cheese sandwich for breakfast. And iced coffee. I do regular coffee, but it's too freaking hot for hot coffee. So let's grab work, ladies and gentlemen. I'm finally home, 
and today well when i wake up later because i just got home and i should go to sleep but i don't know i've been like in the mood to watch a lot of youtube videos lately i don't know just getting ideas i guess but i am finally home and i'm gonna take a nappy poo maybe and today is my friday Yay! we'll see what happens this weekend i'm supposed to hang out with my dad since um i didn't see him on father's day because i had to work even though i did go to my mom's that day but anyway this is supposed to happen i don't know i kind of wanted to go to the beach because it's been effing hot today's supposed to be like 105 degrees but i don't know i'm not feeling the heat lately but when i'm in the pool i love it sour cream <laughs> I got three packets with the guaca chips. With the guaca chips. Guaca chips. Where's the tapatio? Oh, it's hot. I gave these to my nephew to die. You know what he's doing? So he grabbed it like this and he put it in his mouth and he's just like sucking the sour cream. And he kept dipping it, it's sucking the mm -hmm. sour cream. I said, and he said, oh, that's, a, he said that's hot. I said, would you, do you eat a hot?